Oh, oh yes! No way! Yes! <laughs> yes! Dude, MVPs, absolutely Simula and Emma Frost. That was awesome. Thank you so much for being here. And MCOC Noob, make sure you check out Simula and MCOC Noob's guides. Uh, this was the completion run. Um, and I think we're going to have at least one seven star, another seven star crystal. So let's go ahead and open these up. This is cool. Um, no, no, I don't think I will. <laughs> What should we open up first, Sim? What do you think? Uh, probably the basic sevens. Okay, let's do it. Uh, I, I, oh no, I asked Sim and then I didn't do it. That is bad, bad. I mean, you is, could do the relics first. It's no, fine. that is that is like asking someone which car, like to <laughs> to to cut the deck and then you don't do what they said. That is a sure way to lose all your money immediately in Vegas. Um, uh, shard crystals tab. Yeah, okay. You can tell I'm excited. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh we got we got two. We got two seven star crystals to open. Let's get a juggernaut and let's awaken spot. Oh, we're at it, right? I mean, come on, that's easy to do. Uh I feel like I'm facing a lot of juggernauts <laughs> in battlegrounds. <laughs> they're hiding too, because they're not awakened and they're ranked two and they're all the way at the bottom. <laughs> I wouldn't mind awakening silk too. That would be good. I seriously, I, whatever. I don't even care. I'm so happy about how well the boss went um, that I don't even care. I do care, but um. <laughs> that's a dupe I would like. But I, I, I get it, Sig eighty. Yeah, <laughs> I get it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, whatever. I mean, she actually did some really good stuff in War, and mm -hmm. shockingly, was not slow in Battlegrounds. Um, so. Yeah. All right. Well, we got we got more. We got more where, where that came from. So that's not going to slow us down. Let's do a third one too, if you want to. Yeah. 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 Oh, uh, let's do it. If you're uh, if you're around, I know it's getting late. All right, come on. I'm good. Is this one going to be the juggernaut? Is this going to be the silk? Is it going to be the spot? Okay. Never going to complain about that. Never, ever, ever until he's SIG 200s in my battleground stack. I want that SIG going up. SIG 80. Good. Good. That is what that is. Those are the sorts of misses we want around here. Those are the sorts of misses we want around here. Uh, Joey, I mean, her SIG is good. What's up, Joey? What's up, Akbar? Thanks for being here. <laughs> Fausty, what's up, dude? What's up, Fausty? All right, cool. Uh, let's pop a couple six stars so we can get one more seven star crystal. Actually, you know what? I don't. I don't think this is going to be good. I'll, I'll admit. I think the Titan's going to be great, though. Who are you hoping for? Um. I mean, I would love to awaken Kushala. I got onslaught in my last Titan, so um, I would love to awaken <laughs> him as well. Um. He. I'd love to get Chill. I would love to get Chill. The pool is so good. There's like barely any misses in there. Yeah. yeah. Even the misses are like, I'll get over it, you know? Mm -hmm. Not Rocket Raccoon. I would have loved for it to have stopped on court. This is the thing. I mean, the seven star pool is still, it is really good, especially people who live through the initial six star pool. Um, oh, yeah. <laughs> you can tell. You can. I think you can kind of tell veterans who are like, well, it's really good. And people are like, in comparison to what? And you're like, let me show you what the six star pool look like, <laughs> you know? Uh, um, so, yeah, but that's obviously not what I wanted. Uh, but I told you, I didn't think it was going to be good. So here we go. We are on to the Titan. To the Titan. Where is it? Where are you? Here we go. So, I mean, uh, Bullseye would be great. White Tiger would be great. Onslaught would be great. Red Skull would be great. Chill would be great. I actually would love to awaken my Morbius. Warwolf by Night would be great. Kushala would be great. Uh, awakening my Destroyer would be awesome. Serpent would be good just to get that going, even though I have the six star. Uh, I like Ironheart. I, I, you, are you, you're liking yours, yeah? I, I took mine to rank three 
So there you go. After but I finished exploration. So, that's all you yeah. need to hear right there. <laughs> Luke Cage has been destroying stuff. People are doing good things with dust. Like, this is going to be good. I can tell. I can tell. Here we go. So many, it's weird, is there's so many champions I would love to awaken. That feels unusual going into the Titan. That's a new experience for me. Oh, that's so good. <laughs> oh, man. What is this? It, he crashes the game when he comes out of crystals. <laughs> <laughs> I can't tell if you're... <laughs> I mean, I... That's so good. Oh, congrats, dude. I love it. Oh, he really does. <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> I broke the game. I broke the game. We did it. We did it. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I thought the joke was just you were being clever. I didn't realize the the joke was like no, he actually crashes the game. <laughs> Uh, and Trascus, that is the Brazilian uh, DC Wonder Woman. She's a, um, it's a good read. <laughs> it is a good read. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I, I, uh, I, you know that that's a great pull because I did feel like it hard stopped and Kushala was next and I'm still happy. Like, I'm, Either I'm way, it would have been good. Yeah, but like, before we go yep. in any farther, I think a massive thank you needs to go to one to the chat. Thank you guys all for like the this third fight I did way harder than I thought it was going to be. Thank you so much. And then incredible credit to MS uh, to MSD for stepping on call, coaching me through it. It really helped put together so much of what the chat was trying to tell me. And then obviously adding on from your knowledge set. And then last but not least, Simula and uh, MCOC New, without their guides, I, I mean, I didn't spend a single unit on this fight, uh, which feels great. Um, so huge thank you to everyone. MSD is on call. Thank you so much, man, for uh, stepping on and doing this. This was incredible. Absolute pleasure. I'm glad to see you get it down. Yeah, I still stand by, even though that, that I think almost because it was so hard, Although I was already feeling this way, because it was so hard for me, this last run or whatever you want to call it, set of links, furthers my idea that this is, for me, the best, best fight, uh, best boss fight Kabam's ever produced. I, You could get better at it. Uh, it was really nice. It was really, really nice. Okay. Uh, we should open up... I think the 2-3 gem first, right? Yeah, that's what everyone's been doing, and myself included. It just helps you open up the options of the Nexus Crystal and the Class Crystal. I, I couldn't not, I couldn't let that, that Crystal go by just in case. Uh, it felt really good to not use any units or anything on, on this. So um, nothing wrong with using units if that's what you're doing. It just felt really good to do it. Uh, all right, where is this Crystal? It's pretty down there. All right. There it is. Um, no joke. I would be incredibly happy with any of them. Skill and Cosmic are the only ones I probably won't use right away. I would almost definitely at least wait until spring cleaning. I don't know when that's happening. Um, you know, end of April, I think. So um, Mystic would be awesome. Mutant would be awesome. Uh, Science. I mean, there's so many good seven stars out there. And I'm fortunate that I have a lot of them. So, yeah, here we go. In chat, seriously, thank you. I saw all the GGs and congrats and all that stuff. Thanks to everyone for sticking with and cheering and having a lot of fun here. This is just going to, I think, make the crystals more exciting more than anything because it's more like, cool, what are we potentially ranking up? Okay, science. I, I, <laughs> are there any good seven, uh, seven star science champions out there? <laughs> Not that I've heard of. Yeah, I, don't, I can't even think of one. <laughs> all right. That, I mean, that's awesome. Like, yeah, like if I awaken my silk, uh, I want to learn how to play it really well, but I saw the silk comment there. So, okay, so now I think. Now you probably want to go basics, then Nexus, then Class Crystal. 
Yeah. Okay. So that's that sounds right to me. So let's open this up. Um, would love to awaken Silk, Spot, or get Juggernaut. Or of course, Sigs on any uh, champion I already got ranked up, like Crossbones, Korg, Killmonger, America Chavez, Shuri. Like, I, there's just a ton that I would just love to get Sigs on. So it's all gravy. Hulk would be great. Thank you. Danny Moonstar would have probably been even better. Hulk is great. I am um, have an embarrassment of riches here. What's up, Faust? Thanks for being here, bud. So now... So here, here, uh, MSD, you are going to get to decide this. Because I think we're out of... Oh, no, I have a Nexus to open, right? A seven-star Nexus? Yes, you have a Nexus. All right, dude. There might be a lot of pressure on you for this next one, okay? Just want you to know. Oh, joy. Yeah, you're going to get to make a big decision. Oh, that lags. <laughs> um, I'd probably go Warlock out of this selection, unless Shuri is prestige. So I, I, I mean, not that prestige doesn't matter at all. My alliance does do map eight, um, but Shuri's not even rank three. None of these are rank three. They're all great, right? Like any, everyone in the chat's probably like, I would love that Nexus. Um, Warlocks, it'll just increase the damage of Warlock Sig, right? Um, yeah, yeah. I mean, out of these three, already having them awakened, that's what I would value the most. Because Shuri only needs the dupe one time to gain the most significant benefit from it. Yeah. And then Mango is fine at 80. He's fine at 40. But Warlock, he just continues to get that small trickle of benefit. Yeah. And every additional number helps, especially in, in Battlegrounds, if you get him at a high rank. You know, I, I, you're to the shock of no one, you're making a lot of sense, and you're right. You mentioned Prestige, though, and if I had gotten tech, Shuri was probably who was going up. Okay. So... There's not a wrong pick here. I mean, if you want to go Shuri... Yeah, I, I have no qualms about that. You know, I took Shuri to rank three. She's six sixty now for me, and and I don't mind getting the, the awakened on her. Yeah, I I, I think. But you're right. It's it, it's just Sig one where she blocks the unblockable special, right? Yeah. Okay. All right. So now here's the here's the big one, dude. Uh, we'll do the Titan last, but here's here's where you will fully decide this. Oh it's boy, a, it's a class crystal. Okay. I do not have Juggernaut. Mm. I don't have seven star Juggernaut. So okay. the, the I'm a big fan. I'm a big believer. You open the crystal that gives you the best chance to get the champion you most want. I don't know if I necessarily most want Juggernaut, but I definitely feel in Battlegrounds the fact that I don't have one. I feel the same way. <laughs> um, <laughs> but I also really would love to awaken my Silk and my spot. Silk, I would consider taking to rank three. Spot, I probably would not. I'm not as skilled as Legacy, so I don't think I'd be able to make him as good as Lags does. But I love playing Spot, so Spot would probably go to rank two. Silk, if I could get her down, would definitely be a rank three option, and I just pulled a Science Gem. So, do I go Science, or do I go Mystic for this uh, class crystal? I think because you listed two options in science and only one in mystic, it makes more sense to go science, especially considering you just got the two to three science gem. Okay, so science, right? And then this would work like a selector, right? That's how this works? Yeah, it's a crystal crystal. So you open it and then it's okay. like a nexus and then you pick. Uh, very kind of you, Lags. I really enjoyed your R3 video on spot uh, you just put out. Okay, so we're going science. All right. Okay. I, I seriously want to... It's weird because how this game is, I want... Silk the one that I would, I would almost... I, I don't know. She'd be right there for me in the R3 conversation. Silk, I said I probably, or Spot, I said I probably wouldn't. And yet I actually, I, I kind of want the Awakening on Spot more for some reason. He's so much fun. 
Here we go. But spot or silk would just be... I do have a voice volume cap, dude, so I shouldn't scream in your ear, but if I get one of them, we're screaming. Okay. Duly noted. Spider ham would be a great miss. We're just throwing that out there. Okay, there's a third. Yes! Woo! Great! Ah, dude, and when Silk was the next oh. one, it was like... So, all, yeah, I was yeah. going to say, you were set up, man. Oh, yeah. Like, all concern went away. When I saw... Because I was like, I think it's going a little fast for it to be Spider-Ham. And then I saw Silk's red, uh, like, face mask or what, what have you. And I was like, dude, we're in. It's gravy no matter what. Dude, that might be my R3. I would do it in a heartbeat. Awaken Spider-Ham? Easily. I wouldn't even hesitate. I also have Titanium Hulk, though. So, um... I would maybe hesitate a little bit. Yeah! <laughs> um... Dot here to see it. That's awesome. Uh, all right. And then I think that's it, except for... That's it, as if it wasn't very much. I think, um... I think we got the Titan, and then I think we're done. Yeah. Uh, I will, I'm not going to rank up Aang right now because, I, I mean, I do kind of want to do the spider hand, but I, I think I should at least wait uh, and think it through. Um, on this one, I mean, y'all know who I want, right? Um, I've, and my Titan luck has been insane. So I would love to awaken Onslaught, Serpent, or Kushala. I would love to get Chill. Uh, Bullseye would be a, a disaster for my opponents. Um... Yeah, there's so many wins. There's so many wins. And I, I think because of Spider-Ham and all this, man, like, I'm honestly like, yeah, whatever I get. <laughs> oh, Werewolf. I would love Werewolf. Would that be a first time? Yeah. Yeah, I don't have a Werewolf either. Ooh. So. I heard he's pretty good. I've heard good things. A certain young man put out a great showcase. Come on. Let's get something good. Oh. No way! Yes! <laughs> yes! Oh, I thought it was gonna I thought it was gonna roll over. That would have been like my fifth havoc. But awakening onslaught. Absolutely. Big ups to the chat and MSD. You guys are the heroes of this stream. Oh my god. This is what it's all about, man. Thank you so much for joining Call MST. Chat, I see you on lag, Mike, Thomas, Captain Bay. Thank you, everyone, for here. Thanos, you were here for the whole thing, giving me tips. Thank you, huge thank you to Karate Mike, Big Evil, Ozfan, all for the generous donations and support. Big Evil, what's up, man? Uh, you guys make this awesome. The, honestly, this is why streaming is fun. This is why having a YouTube channel is fun. It's because of you all. Uh, MSD, you don't mind, take us out, man. Uh, thanks so much, everybody. I'll catch you all really, really soon. MSD, if you don't mind, take us out. Make sure to hit the like button, everybody. Subscribe to Vega if you have not already, and hit the bell for notifications. We will see you all in the next one. Peace out, everybody. Take care.